What's up, my LS Crazy Amigos? Your boy, Terry. Speaking from the garage shop once again. Here to offer you some more Big Bang for the Buck product and info. Yeah! I finally figured out which engine I'm going to nestle this LSA on. <laughs> That's right. The Trailblazer SS. I'm going to put this LSA on my Trailblazer SS. Yes, the cat's out the bag. <laughs> I always thought cats and guitars have a similar sound to them. <laughs> always thought that. But anyways, we got the LSA almost prepped up. We got the bottom half prepped. Uh, snoot snout almost prepped. But we're going to do the final steps of preparing this snoot snout before we made it to the supercharger, which then it's one. We got the, we got the mutant glue that GM used, so we're going to made it together. Now, unless you have the engine and the harness out of the car, computer out of the car, that you're mounting it into an old school ride like a Chevelle or pretty much a Trailblazer SS, then you're not going to need this because we're going to bypass this. So, put that down. And so, what you're going to do is you're going to have it, you're going to leave this open. Next thing we're going to do is, you see this line right here? We're going to take this off of the snoot snout. We're not going to remove it because we're going to put it on the base of the supercharger. So we're going to just basically relocate it. Like that. We're just going to move it out the way for, us, for, for a second or two. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to adjust. You see that butterfly in the, supercharger, in the snoot? You see that? Open it up like that. If it's slightly open, you're going to lose a little boost. You're going to lose anywhere from a half to about two pounds of boost. And we want to keep all that beautiful boost. All right? So the first thing we're going to do, you got two 10 millimeter bolts. You're going to unloosen them, and then this piece right here will move. So just move this into the position when that butterfly is closed so you can keep your boost. So now this goes without saying, anytime you have two metal pieces that are going to be made together, you want to make sure that they're very, very clean for good adhesion. So what I did was I went and got some prep oil and just wiped it up. Now you can go, and here's the GM Mutant Glue that I'm using, all right? AC Delco, uh, RTV, silicone sealant. Now the last time I did it, it was black, but this one is kind of grayish, so we're gonna see how it is. You definitely want to have a nice, bead. You may have to clean it up a little, make sure there's no thin spots. If there is, apply a little bit more, but make sure that the bead is intact and it looks like one continuous bead. Then you're ready to install. Take your new solid isolator in the hole uh, and there you go. You want to make sure these three shafts go into these three holes. When I install it, I like to put one of these shafts at 12 o'clock, 12 o'clock. Down for the count. Then you got your 10 millimeter bolts, four the same size. Two or, the, two or longer, and you can see <laughs> where these two are gonna go. One's gonna go, the long ones are gonna go, one's gonna go on the bottom, and one's gonna go right next to the actuator. Yeah. The other four go on the base, good to go. Then you wanna torque it to 20 foot pounds. Don't forget to wallop it with a mallet. That's the seat, the isolator. So it spins nice and freely. You got these two little vacuum ports right here that you're not gonna use because, you know, you're putting in these old school cars, you're not, it doesn't call for it. So you wanna block them off. Now they make these block off plates. I got mine from LSX Precisioning and they fit right in the hole and you got a little screw down and you got a little rubber grommet that make sure that it's not a leak. But I, again, cheap insurance, what I like to do is take a little bit of the sealant again, and put it in place, 
tighten it down. So now this LSA is ready to nestle on top of this engine. But you remember this line right here where I said just leave it hanging? You thought I forgot, didn't you? you thought, I know you guys thought I forgot, but I didn't. You remember how I said just leave it hanging? Now what you're going to do is you're going to attach it to the vacuum port little spout on the LSA right here. So it's going to go from the actuator to the LSA. What's going to happen is the vacuum that's created is what's going to open up the butterfly, which creates the boost, 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 boost. So that's why you want to use the vacuum off of this. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is all I have for today because I'm looking at the clock on the wall. Or should I say ceiling? It's time for me to head on off and continue with this project because we know where this LSA is going to go. That's right. I just want to say at this time, thank you guys for all the love, all the support, and all the fun because I'm, I'm having a good time doing these videos and I hope you're enjoying them. You know what? Right now, hit the subscribe button. Might as well do it. Let's get it out the way. Let's get it out the way right now. Hit that subscribe button, right? And right next to the subscribe button, you know what I'm talking about? That little bell? You want to hit that because what that does is that notifies you. You get an email saying, Coverman66, Terry, has put another video out. And you don't want to miss it because, like I said, I have tons of videos. Tons of videos that are getting ready to get dropped. So, I appreciate all the love and support. I really do. And I want to thank you, you, you. Yeah, you with the hot dog. Yeah, you, 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 you. That's right. You getting out the shower. That's right. I want to thank all of you, every one of you guys. I really appreciate the love and support. But as always, I'm looking at that clock on the wall. And it says it's time for me to head on off. So, as always, as always, be easy. And I'll catch you guys real soon. Take care.